So you have dry flaky scalp in the winter. Any suggestions to help with that? Um, so my guess what's happening is that um, in the winter time, because my skin is extremely dry because one, the air is a lot drier in the winter and two, you know, you're indoors with forced heat which also sucks the moisture out. It sucks the moisture out of your skin. It sucks the moisture out of your hair. It just sucks in general, right? Um, so some of the things that I do at home is I have like two humidifiers. I have two humidifiers in my room because I personally like humidity. I like when my space feels like a rainforest. So, um, and plus I have a ton of plants. And so... I started using humidifiers pretty much everywhere I can. So I would suggest trying to, if you don't have a humidifier, getting one so that you can put that moisture back into the air so that it's not sucking as much out of your skin and your scalp. The other thing um, you might want to do is switch to heavier emollient rich products. So for example, um, like for some people, when my hair used to be medium porosity and that's because I used to color my hair. I don't color my hair anymore. I found that in the winter, my moisturizing hair pudding wasn't enough to lock that moisture in because the air was pulling the moisture out. So then I would um, layer my pudding with my sealing hair butter. The butter is a much thicker product and that made a difference. And of course, like we can't help it when you're applying the products to your hair, it's going to get on your scalp. And as long as it's a product that helps your hair, your skin to breathe. So that's when you're using products where the, um, it's a creamy water based products. So you might need to also just switch to heavier products. Um, and I would say reduce or avoid using stylers. So those are your gels, your mousses, those sorts of things. Those are great in the summer um, when you want to repel the moisture, but because in the winter time, it's the air is sucking the moisture from you, you want to maybe um, use products that's going to lock in that moisture. So you don't need to use stylers as much. Um, so try those little swaps and keep me posted. Let me know how it goes.